girls, welcome back to my channel. Grab it, it's been over a month since I filmed my last beauty video or beauty related video. Lagi lang ako nag <laughs> Lagi lang ako nag vlog. And I do apologize, pero yun, I'm filming another one today. And today we are trying new Korean beauty stuff. Ayan. Ito yung mga binigay sa akin ng AJO Skin and Beauty. Thank you so much, AJ, para sa mga ito. Pasensya na natagalan yung paggawa ko ng video, but I am doing it today. And without any further ado, magsimula na tayo. And, oh, di ba, Pasko, Pasko tayo. Meron ako snowman dyan, may pailaw-ilaw dyan, tapos may pa-Christmas tree din ako na gold. Actually, pwede ko itong pailawan, pero I don't know kung maganda siya. Ayan. Mas magan... Ano bang mas maganda sa video? May ilaw o wala? Ay, pero maganda siya may ilaw. Ito, may ilaw din to eh. Ayun. Oo, oh, diba? Ang cute. <laughs> okay, anyway, let's move on. And, oo oh, nga, sinabi ko nga na medyo tanghaling tapat. Alas do, so it's very hot. So, pasensya na kung meron kayo marinig na background noise. Kung gagamitin ko yung aking mini fan right here. Kasi in in best. Okay. Anyway, let's move on. If you haven't watched yung haul where I featured this and other Korean skincare products, I'll put it in the description box below as well kung gusto niyo. Meron ako dito makeup pearl mist. I don't know if I can use this before makeup, pero walang nakalagay dito. Actually, meron pero mga Korean na sulat. So, wag na lang. Okay, so I don't really have anything on my face except for moisturizer. Kakatapos ka lang maligo. And we're going to start with this Get New Skin All Wanted Aqua Collagen Tight to the Skin in the Rising of Subungam and Young Yangam. <laughs> Smooth Skin Losing Elasticity and Administration Tasks. White and anti-wrinkle siya and it contains SPF 50 PA++++. Bonga. Sabi dito, it's a nutritious, vital, special BB dation. So, it's a BB cream and a foundation in one. That's cool. As usual, hindi natin mabasa ang nasa likod kasi napaka Korean niya. Puro Korean yung sulat na oom. And the box is holographic. Ang bonga. Yung nababasa ko lang dito is it says it's whitening, anti-wrinkle, UV block functions, and hydrolyzed collagen 0.1. It's good. 12 months after opening and obviously it was made in Korea. Tignan niyo yung box niya. Holographic. Ang cute ng box. Ta-da! Anyway, buksan na natin siya, guys. Okay, ayan siya. This is the actual packaging. Medyo nagre-reflect yung light. Ayan! Medyo metallic blue kasi yung packaging niya. Kaya nagre-reflect yung light. It just comes in this plastic tube. This one contains 50 ml of the product. So, marami na siya, guys, in fairness. By the way, for the prices, I'll put them in the description box below or ilalagay ko din sila sa screen habang mini-mention ko sila para I will really mention the correct price. <laughs> and of course, ilalagay ko din yung link ng Agio Skin and Beauty. Doon yung mabibili yung mga Korean beauty products na ito. I'll put it in the description box below as well. Alright, let's go ahead and open this up. And actually, meron tong seal nung natanggap ko. Pero syempre, since I did a haul, ginusto ko siyang iswatch. Kaya tinanggal ko na siya. Ang lucky! 50ml best. I cannot believe it. Okay. Let's put some on the back of my hand. It's a little thick. <laughs> Napaka-thick niya, best. Ang hirap niyang i-squirt out. Tapos parang naparami tuloy yung nakuha ko. Anyway, that's how the product looks like. Parang kailangan niya ng mas malaking buta sa kanya. Pero, ayan na nga yung product. Medyo, ano siya, pink undertone, as you can see. Pero let's see kung mag adjust ba siya sa ating skin tone. Alright guys, so lapit ako ng konti para mas makita niyo how the product works on my skin. By the way, as you can see, I have a lot of pimples and acne scars. Pangit na skin ko best. I'm so sorry, but yan talaga ang katotohanan. And then, I'm going to put just small dots on my face para oh, it feels very creamy like kapag naganyan mo na siya parang hindi na siya thick yung feeling niya. <laughs> hindi ko pala nakita kung meron siyang shade. Walang nakasulat dito kung anong shade niya. Probably it only has one shade, like one shade fits all, mga ganon. Parang free size, basta mga damit. As plus size girls can relate na mahirap ang mga plus size na yan. So, tignan natin. Kamusta naman ang ating one shade fits all. I'm gonna try using a flat top foundation brush to blend this all in. And ultimately, nakikita ko na parang it 
blends into nothing. Very, very sheer ang kanyang coverage, guys, as in. Which actually, kung gusto niyo ng mga super light coverage, okay na okay na to. Pero as you know, ako, I like full coverage or at least a medium coverage man lang. Pero ito, it only has light or very sheer na coverage, as you can see. It did make my skin look healthy and hindi siya ganun ka dewy basta parang natural skin like finish lang also feels very light on the face parang wala ako na feel na may nilagay ako na foundation or bb cream super light sa face and it blends very easily yung problema ko lang sa kanya is walang coverage or very very light coverage lang siya again it all boils down to personal preference feeling ko for this one i'm going to use it as like sunscreen i'm gonna put it before foundation or kung nandito lang ako sa bahay of course i can wear this on its own tsaka parang super nagmatch sa skin tone ko kasi nga it blends into nothing all right so there we go i finished applying the bb dation on the rest of my face and super ganda ng finish niya guys as in very skin like kung gusto mong ma-achieve yung mga no makeup makeup look magugustuhan mo siguro itong foundation or bb dation na to pero again for me since i like full coverage hindi ko siya masyado nagustuhan and right now medyo na feel ko merong mainit sa kanya ewan ko bakit parang mainit siya hindi naman siya heavy pero mainit yung feeling niya i don't know why pero siguro right now since magfi-film pa ako ng ibang videos later papatungan ko siya ng ibang foundation I hope it's okay with you, pero kailang ko gawin yun kasi magpifil pa ako na ibang video. Okay, so gagawin ko muna yun and I'll apply some concealer and I'll get back to you guys later. Okay, baby girl, so ako yung nagbabalik and I have my full face on. <laughs> o oh, ba? parang ang puti ng mukha ko, pasensya na kayo. Maputi kasi talaga siguro tong ano, ito, I don't know, pero... Anyway, magiging okay din ang lahat mamaya. Yung powder na gagamitin ko is this... I don't know paano siya basahin. Bew Skin? Bow Skin? Collagen UV 2-Way Cake. Oh, meron din siyang SPF 40 PA++. And I got mine in the shade 23 or Natural Beige. 2-Way Cake siya. So, pwede din pala ito na lang yung foundation mo. Basahin mo lang yung sponge. Okay, basahin natin kung ano yung mga mabasa natin dito sa likod. And it turns out... Wala tayong mabasa. Ang kakaloka, puro koreano best. And made in Korea siya and it contains 13.5 grams of the product. <laughs> and it is made in Korea. Sinabi ko na ba yun? Oo. It's good 12 months after opening. And ito na nga yung actual na packaging niya. Ang cute best. Oh my gosh. Very unique. I like it. Tapos sa likod, ayan, ganyan lang siya. Ang cute! Nagustuhan ko yung packaging. Tapos medyo nakakatakot din siya. Anyway. <laughs> okay, so when you open it up, it looks like this. It has a good-sized mirror. Tapos medyo sosya lang kanyang puff. Oh. Mm, bongga. And then, ganito yung itsura ng powder. I don't know, parang medyo dark yung powder. As you can see. Ang cute kasi may division ang puff. At saka yung powder. Nabonggahan ako dun. Oh! The powder feels very smooth. Bongga. Feels very finely milled. Kaya lang parang medyo dark siya. Hmm. Siguro I'll try using the puff that it comes with. Parang medyo dark na talaga siya. Oh. Pero, let's see. Oh, it smells really nice. Parang may... Parang amoy baby na perfume. Amoy pang baby na perfume. Bongga. Okay. Okay din naman pala yung shade. Oh. Ang puti ng mukha ko dito sa camera ng to ah. Nakakaloka. Hindi ako, hindi ako sanay na itong camera to yung ginagamit ko eh. Pero I thought, why not? Try natin. Ang ingay ng ano no, electric pan. Pasensya na kayo guys. Ngay ing. Ang init-init kasi. Ang sarap ng feeling ng puff niya. I love it. Hindi siya yung mga cheap na puff. Instantly mattifies my face. Like, tignan nyo, yung noo ko, medyo shiny pa siya kasi wala pa siyang powder. And, tada! Instantly mattifies it. Diba, dito matte, dito medyo dewy siya. Ang bongga. Uy, I like this powder! Parang nag add siya ng coverage and you know, I love me some coverage. So, yes, pile on that powder. 
Ang ganda ng powder. Medyo sinalpak ko lang talaga siya dyan. And I'm going to leave it like that for a while. And then I'm gonna do my brows. Tapos babalik ako and then i-brush off natin yung excess powder in our face. So parang nag-bake na rin ako gamit siya. Pero not really. Pero kind of. And yun. Maglalagay ako ng kilay. Tapos blush na rin. Kasi wala akong blush dito. And yun lang yung gagawin ko. Okay? I'll be back later again. <laughs> okay, baby girl. So, nagbabalik na naman ako. So, na-brush off ko na yung excess powder on my face. Tapos, nagano din ako bronzer, blush, highlight, and nagkilay na rin ako. So, now, since medyo powdery ang ating look ngayon, I will be using the 3W Clinic Makeup Pearl Mist. Ito siya. Yan, ito yung itsura niya, guys. Ang cute, diba? Tapos, super mura lang nito, guys. As in, compared to other makeup mists. Made in Korea siya. It's good 12 months after opening. And what else? What else? Wala. Yun lang. Yun lang ang nakasulat dito. If you look at it closely, makikita nyo na parang meron siyang mga glitters glitters na ganap dyan sa kanya. So, I'm very curious to see kung kamusta naman ang mist na ito. Kung maganda ba siya mag-set ng makeup. If it can prolong my makeup on my face. Usually, yung foundation ko nagbe-break up siya right here. So, tignan natin at the end of the day kung mangyayari ba yun or hindi. Makakatulong ba to para hindi mangyari yun sa ating face? We shall see. Tignan natin na yung mist niya. Oh. Ooh, it smells... Medyo yung amoy niya kind of smells like pang lalaki na perfume. Mga ganun. At nandiyo na pala kayo kung medyo maingay kasi... Gumamit ako ng electric pan. <laughs> okay. Spray na natin siya. Okay. Yung mist niya, hindi siya ganun ka-fine talaga. Medyo mafe-feel mo talaga yung pak. Ganyan na. Too big sa yung face. Pero, it's fine. Try natin kung malayo talaga yun. Ooh. Ang bango. Parang amoy lalaki talaga siya. Parang amoy pabango ng lalaki. And then, kung medyo malayo mo naman siya imi-mist, uh, maganda naman yung pagka-mist niya sa iyong face. Hindi siya yung pak, basang-basa talaga. And, tatuyuin muna natin siya ng sandali sa ating mukha para makita natin kung nakatulong naman talaga siya para mawala yung powdery look ng ating face. Parang may naglalaro sa labas ng cellphone, guys. Pasensya na kayo ha, kung naririnig na yun. Ooh, girl! Parang gumanda nga ang ating pagmumukha, oh. Parang naging smooth ang ating makeup tignan. Ang bongga. Hala, nagustuhan ko siya. In fairness. Hala, I really see a difference. Tapos, wala naman ako masyado nakikita ang glitter sa aking face. Merong konti. Pero, hindi naman siya masyadong noticeable like what I expected. Okay naman siya. I'm liking it. Okay, ayan. So, tuyo na yung aking pamumukha. And as you can see, Napaganda niya guys, napaganda ng mist ang paglapat ng makeup sa aking face. It doesn't look super fake and super cake and super powdery. Ang ganda! Nagustuhan ko siya. Okay. Meron akong eyeliner din dito and this is from the brand Tony Moly. Yeah, Tony Moly Easy Touch na liquid eyeliner. Sabi dito it's good 6 months after opening. It's in the shade number 1 and it's made in Korea. Wait, bubuksan ko muna. Then, I will let you see the packaging. Ayan yung packaging niya. Makikita niya yan. Easy touch. Tapos, ganito lang naman talaga yung packaging ng mga normal na liquid eyeliner, guys. So, nothing different. And it has a brush tip applicator na medyo manipis din naman. As you can see. Tignan natin, makakagawa ba tayo ng magandang eyeliner application? Kasi hindi naman talaga ako madalas naga-eyeliner, but we'll see. Tignan nyo, ganyan nilang yung ginawa ko na eyeliner. Ganyan yung gusto ko na eyeliner lately. Tapos hindi ko na pinapasok masyado dito. Parang okay naman siya guys. In fairness, super dali lang gumawa ng wing. So there we go. That's my super mini wing. Na nasa outer corners lang. Super dali naman yung gamitin. And let's see kung andyan pa rin siya at the end of the day. Kung hindi ba siya bag sa smudge. Kasi yung eyes ko are very watery. So madalas nagtitear up ako. Ito tsaka dito. So let's see kung this will hold up para sa aking very watery eyes. And meron din akong mascara dito from Tony Moly. It's called the Delight Circle Lens Mascara. Again, buksan muna natin siya. 
para mapakita ko sa inyo yung packaging. It says here that it's made in Korea and good six months after opening. So yung packaging niya looks like this. It's very cute. Gusto ko yung mint green, mint na packaging or na cover dito. Tsaka yung mint green na sulat. Ayan. Tignan naman natin what the wand looks like. Ooh, medyo malaki yung wand niya. Pero hindi naman masyadong malaki. Tapos it looks like parang meron siyang mga fiber fiber. Curl muna natin yung ating lashes. Ayan yung mascara guys. Maganda naman siya. Nasi-separate niya yung lashes ko. Pero wala ako masyado nakikitang volume. Medyo nalilengthen niya yung lashes. Pero volume wala masyado. Wow! This mascara looks great sa lower lashes guys. I love it. Ta-da! I finished applying the mascara and I love how it looks sa lower lashes. And now we're down to the last product that we are going to try. Meron akong lip tint dito. And it's this one, the Pony Effect Soul Deep and Pure Lip Tint. Ayan, that's how it looks like. Ang cute ng packaging niya, parang social na social tingnan. Black tapos, parang rose gold. It contains 8.5 grams of product. Staying rich color, all-in-one effect formula, moisture ink type. Meron akong tatlong shades dito. I have beautiful, delightful, and blissful. Ito yung shade na beautiful, guys. Very nice pink color. And then, next to that, I have the shade blissful. Ang ganda. Very rich in pigment. Okay, the last shade is delightful. And this one is like a warm red shade. Ayan siya. Oh. Ang ganda. Ito pala sila, guys. Parang magkaiba yung scent nila. I don't know if that's just me. Pero... It smells fruity, pero hindi naman siya yung normal na fruity scent na citrusy or parang berry na kulay. And ultimately, nag-tint na siya sa aking kamay. Kahit na sinwatch ko lang naman siya sandali. Ang ganda ng packaging, in fairness. Oh, just comes in this black plastic tube. Tapos, ang ganda. I love it. Tapos yung sulat niya, rose gold. And it comes with an applicator. Ayan, meron siyang parang wand na applicator which I appreciate. Siguro itry natin yung parang koreana na lips. Siguro itry natin yung parang koreana na lips na sa loob lang nilalagyan. Ooh, wala din siyang mapait na lasa sa kanya. Gradient lips. Char. Okay, so, ito na yung ating final look, guys. Sana nagustuhan niyo naman kahit papano. And, medyo fresh-fresh lang siya. Medyo Korean-Korean. And, nagustuhan ko naman yung mga ginamit ko. Except lang dun sa BB Dacian. Kasi nga, wala siya, mas wow, wala siya masyadong coverage. But, the rest, nagustuhan ko naman sila ng bonggang-bongga. And, I will be wearing this throughout the entire day. Medyo happy na ngayon. Pasensya na. But, it is now... Woo! 3:37 p.m. Babalik ako mami at the end of the day to give you an update kung kamusta na ang status ng ating pagbumuka. I'll see you guys later. Hey baby girls, mag-update ako sa lip product ko. Nakatapos ko lang kumain ng carbonara and as you can see, parang wala na siya. Ito na lang natira dito na lang talaga. Mm, so sadly, hindi siya masyadong long lasting. Um, I have yet to try it like on the entire lip talaga. I try natin lang. Let's try a different shade. Probably I'll use the pink one, itong pang virgin. <laughs> ano bang kulay nito? Beautiful. How sad naman, hindi siya nagla-last after eating. Ta-da! So, this is the shade Beautiful. Ang ganda, in fairness. Nakaka-fresh. Akala ko it's going to be like this shade. Yung parang pale pink na color. Pero, medyo mas dark pala siya. Nagustuhan ko siya kasi hindi siya drying. Well, for the amount of time that I wore it, hindi siya drying. Tapos, medyo tacky siya at first, pero nawawala din naman siya after a while. Okay, so tignan naman natin how long this will last on my lips. I'll be back later for another update. It's 10.08pm, so mga 7 hours na siguro itong makeup ko sa aking face. Nakatulog ako, kaya ganito yung aking itsura. Pasensya na. Tignan niyo yung lip tint. Andito pa rin. Pumpunk! Um, okay pa naman yung foundation or yung basta okay pa rin yung aking base makeup yung problema lang is yung dito baka nahawakan ko yan dyan kaya naging ganyan parang natanggal pero overall everything else looks fine sa eyeliner hindi naman siya nag smudge sa aking outer 
corners ng aking mata, okay pa rin naman siya. And yung aking lip tint, okay pa rin siya. It's not drying at all. Bongo! Ang bongo ng lip tint na to, nagustuhan ko siya. Okay yung mascara, andyan pa rin siya. Medyo nakaganyan pa rin naman yung ating lashes. Same lang na itsura kung how it looked like earlier. I think the powder really helped para maging intact pa rin yung makeup ko. Kasi dito, hindi pa nag-break up yung aking makeup. Tapos naka-help din especially yung setting spray siguro. Ooh, I like it. Yung dito na talaga yung nagka-problema kasi natulog akong ganyan. Kaya natanggal siya. Pero overall, I think... Everything was really nice. I think that wraps up this video. Thank you sa inyo guys for watching today's video. My bavlogmas. Bavlogmas. <laughs> Beauty vlogmas, di ba? Pwede ba yun? Pwede naman siguro. And, sana nag-enjoy kayo. I hope this was helpful. Please like this video if you enjoyed. Please subscribe if you haven't yet. And, syempre, click nyo na rin yung bell. Kasi ando na rin naman kayo subscribe. Konting na yan lang. Bell na. I-click nyo na yan. And that's it. Thanks again so much for watching. I hope to see you in the next video tomorrow. Bye! Tsaka yung swatches ko dito, andito pa rin siya. Hindi pa rin siya natatanggal.